In this video, we'll see how to work on text body formatting of email message. Suppose if you are sending an email message, you can change the font color, you can change the font size, you can add some images, etc. You can do much more stuff with that. Let us see that. Now, I'll be sending an email message to one person, okay, and wishing him a birthday. So, I'll say up many, many happy returns of the day and I'll send an email to that person. So, let us see that. Now, in the home tab, I'll just click on this new email. I'll type the name of the person to whom I'm sending an email message. So, pavanlalwani at hotmail.com. The subject would be regarding birthday wishes. And I'll write here as dear Pavan. Many, many happy returns of the day. Regards, tutorials point admin. Okay. If I send this text, uh, this email message, it looks very boring. There's no color formatting. There's no images. So what I can do is I'll try to make into a proper manner, some formatting, some color size, etc. So first thing is I'll select this text, which is wishing him a birthday. Okay. I can just select the text and uh, change the font of this. So I'll select some other font, let's say, I'll select here as, yeah, this font and I'll increase the size of this by just clicking on this capital A button over here. I'll change the color of the text like this, okay. And if I want, yeah, this I have done it. So if I want, I can add some images just to make him feel better that there are some birthday wishes. If you want to add some images, if you have on your desktop, you can use this method you can just keep your cursor at this place because after this text i'll be adding some image so you can just go to this insert tab and if you see there's a pictures option if i click on this pictures it will ask you for the location of picture but right now i do not have any picture at my place so i'll just click on cancel what i will do is i'll try to fetch a picture which is at online so from google or some other option so i'll just go to this option as insert online pictures and it will give me a Bing image search, search the web. So I'll type as birthday, enter. Okay, so I've got so many images. I can just scroll down and select any image here. But what I'll do is I'll select some image like this one. The checkbox is selected here. So this image will be inserted if I click on this insert button. So I'll just click on this insert button. Okay, and this is the image which is inserted. It's a very thin line, you'll not be able to see here. You can see this one. So I'll just try to increase it. I'll try to increase and properly adjust according to my size itself. I'll just reduce the size. Okay, I'll just reduce the size again. Yeah, and yeah, a bit more required to adjust the size. Increase the size this way. Okay, now it looks better rather than sending a simple text. I have just formatted a text. I've inserted some image here. If you want, you can add some PDF, Word document, anything as per your condition, which is required. Finally, if you have done, what you can do is you can just simply, I'll just press enter here. So one space is required. After doing this, simply you can just click on send button like this. And this email will go to pavanlalwani at hotmail.com. So I'll just click on the send button. Now, if you see uh, the email has been gone to the particular person, uh, what I'll do is I'll go to my outbox first. Let me check. I'll go to this outbox to check whether the message is there or not. So there's no message. Now I'll just go back to the sent items, sent email. Okay. And sent email, if you see, yeah, that's the birthday wishes, which is sent here. So if I click on this place on the right hand side, if you see in the reading pane, many, many happy returns of the day and the mail has been sent. So what I'll do is I'll open into the uh, Hotmail account on the browser itself. So I'll open my browser. Yeah. So if you see, I'll click on this birthday. Okay. This one is the message. So it says many, many happy returns of the day. The image is present and at the bottom it says regards tutorials point admin. Fine. So this is the message which I've got. Now I'll come back to my outlook itself. Right. So I hope you're able to understand how to do a text body formatting when you compose an email rather than sending a normal text message. You can just format, add some images, make some formatting type and you can send the email. It looks much more beautiful as compared to a normal text message. That's all for this video.